All right, it's Jay today and Gwen tomorrow. We're back with another adventure. So currently, I'm in Patterson State Park, and I'm gonna make my way over to the Northwoods Harley Davidson in Arbor Vetia. I'm probably slaughtering it. There's another waterfall right there, a little one up there up top. Hmm. Kind of cool. Anyway, so we just visit the the 30 foot, the little Mantu waterfall here and a big one here. You'll have to watch different videos to see that. Uh, this video is going to take me to the North Woods, like I said again. Um, and we got kind of the hike. Apparently, we got 159 miles and two hours and 57 minutes to get over there. Shouldn't be an issue. So. Figured I'd turn the camera on and bring you guys along. <clears throat> Sounds like Superior is going to get some storms here from what my phone was saying. <sighs> if you're ever up in this area in Superior, you wanna see some really cool waterfalls, Patterson State Park here it has two good waterfalls. One's 30 feet, and then uh, I didn't get to see the small one behind there. I probably could have. And then the other one's uh, over 160 feet tall. Uh, both are beautiful waterfalls. So, and they got rain recently, so it is, it's flowing good. Look at that view. Got some oversized load stuff coming through. Look at that mountain. That's really cool. Very neat. Now we're going to make our way back. Going up to 8% incline here. <laughs> I just wonder what back roads it's going to take me on to go over that way because it's kind of a it's kind of a hike
get some gas, then I won't have to fill up again. Alright, so we got some gas now, now we can go. Up and running. around its head and I thought it was a bald eagle but I think they just had he had something in his mouth so I don't think it was a bald eagle It would be nice if the weather would hold off, but now I, I pretty much don't even care. I got to see the waterfalls, didn't get wet. 
Um, and uh, I'm to be honest, I'm happy. You know, that was two cool waterfalls, which are only like miles apart too. Like maybe five miles, if that. I don't even think they're five miles apart. country out here. Look at this road. Look at how it just goes up over there. That's kind of cool. taking a ride up here in about a mile and a half. Oh, it is so windy. <clears throat> and that is a mountain that you're seeing back over there in the foreground. I didn't realize that was one. I was like, oh, that's kind of cool. There's a helicopter too right there. here going to the right now 
have time to follow it all the way around next to the train tracks. Cool little area. <laughs> oh, that is an eagle there. That is an eagle. That is cool. <laughs> I think it's my first eagle, my first wild eagle I got on, on video. So that was pretty cool. That's a cool experience for me. They're so hard to get, it seems like for me. Like I that's one animal that I've struggled with. Well, bear too, but uh, the eagle, like I've, I've had many opportunities. Well, I know a couple opportunities I've had and like, it just was not happening. Like, like I think I spooked them and then they went over a hill where I couldn't see them on a past in a pasture. So it was just like, ah, oh. but that was definitely an eagle. That was kind of exciting. If you would have stayed closer to the road, I'd have probably stopped and uh, filmed him a little bit more. But uh, as you can see, he was not handled. He was he was off. So this road is not nice. <laughs> oh, we're on US. We're gonna be hitting US two. Somebody was just talking about that. That's cool. Hopefully it's better than this road. Going to 53 now. So I think we're on, oh, nope, two. We're on going to two, I guess we're going to. Two east, 53 south, I guess. Two east and 53 south. Let's see where we're going on here. towards Ashland. So 
now we're on US 2E or 2 East. So I've been through Ashland before. It's been a, a while ago. Like I think, in fact, it might have been, there might have been snow on the ground. Um, <clears throat> I wonder if there's a falls over here. I know I should probably not be doing that, but. Let's check out to see if there is a waterfall in a brief moment. And then we'll get on our way. State Park. Waterfalls and covered bridge. So this is where we're gonna go. So there is a waterfall over here and a covered bridge. You can see the water right next to the road, which is kind of cool. One lane bridge. Oh, this is really tight. Holy cow. Let's get out for a minute. All right, so we do have some waterfall. There's like a little one right here. Um, kind of cool and I believe there's one right over here too it's a smaller one obviously than the other ones that we just drove by and this is Amicon State Park here in Wisconsin kind of cool and it looks like they have some channels maybe to come down here into this little waterfall kind of cool I don't know what size that is but uh, that is neat very neat all kinds of little channels for water All right, so we're gonna head on out of the park now and go over this really skinny bridge over here. Like it could be a little bit skinnier, that would be great. <laughs> I'm being sarcastic. Uh, that bridge is really skinny. And they got like, let's see. Got kind of like a waterfall right there a little bit. Wow, that bridge is so skinny. <laughs> couple up here right there just some small waterfalls kind of cool I appreciate them that's pretty neat all right on to our next journey
apparently there's a covered bridge over there somewhere that I, I didn't see it but so we didn't have the time we'll have to come back and see that Off the beaten path. Oh, rough road ahead. I didn't want to see the signs for that. You never want to see that. <laughs> Very jiggly. Almost too jiggly. Almost too jiggly. Wentworth. There's a dip coming up. A dip. Can you dip? Yes, I can. There's a song. I can't remember the name of the song. Can you dip when we dip? Something, something dip. <laughs> Wentworth Gardens. Coming traffic use a center line. I don't I'm pretty sure I didn't read that right. <clears throat> Middle River. Oh, that's a nice... Hey, I think I've been through here. That, that train trestle... No, maybe not. I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Poplar.
Look at that big bright yellow siren to let people know if there's bad or tornado or something. That is huge. train car just sitting there. That's interesting. If it wasn't on a time crunch, I would have explored that state park back there a little bit more uh, to see the wooden bridge, or covered bridge, uh, and also uh, the waterfall. But uh, I've, I've got to be somewhere, and uh, they close at 5, and I'm going to get there around 4.40, because I've got like 2 hours and 26 minutes to get there. So, like... I'm, I'm like pushing it, so, um, wish that wasn't the case though, but it's not the end of the world, we've got many other opportunities to come back up here, to go back to that place, so that'll be cool. I just have to remember. <laughs> like I said, I didn't even know that I was going by it. Oh, that's kind of cool. Some little eagle statues there. Oh, that's a cyber truck. That was a Tesla Cybertruck that we just that was just passed over there. That's interesting. That that's the first one I've actually seen that that's been out. That is really interesting. Huh. Kind of cool what you see out, you know, when you're out exploring. I've never seen one up in person. Uh, like I said, that's the first one. I thought there was like a big recall on all of them, but I don't know. Maple, 45 miles an hour, or to slow it down. Northwestern High School. clearly not open anymore at least that's what it looks like <laughs> that's weird look at my window holy cow should have got windshield wiper fluid <laughs> the guy back there must actually use a saw a chainsaw to actually make his art 
It's pretty cool. A little roadside attraction. Looks like a mountain that we're that that we may be coming up to over here, but I don't know. Like I said, I I'm not. I don't think I've ever been on uh, US two up here. Not that I can remember. Very scenic. Starts to rain. Oh yeah. That looks like a mountain to me. And I do like mountains. Kind of funny how the sun is hitting some of the trees and it's putting out like a white backdrop and then some of the other trees there's it's not a little interesting wow that wind <laughs> State Forest so that's so there's a river coming up and it's Brew River oh did you guys see that sign back there like the wind is just whipping the heck out of that holy cow I'm actually surprised it didn't fall off I mean the wind was whipping that This is Brule River that we're going to be crossing here shortly.
nice little train trail. Is that a walk-in trail? I think that might be a walk. Oh, that is a walk-in trail up on top. I was going to say train trussle, but it's a walk walking trail. They must have got some rain here shortly, as we can see. River 7, Ashland 33. Bayfield County. There's a bow and arrow for you, and an axe, and a fishing pole. <laughs> That's kind of cool. I actually thought like like Ashland was like close to Lake Superior but on the GPS I'm not seeing anything so like I I'm suspecting it's a ways out like it could be a couple miles uh, according to what I'm seeing on the GPS Looks like it's raining up there ahead. Keep forgetting I don't have any windshield wiper fluid. <laughs> I would definitely call this the North Woods of Wisconsin.
lot of lakes up here. all around us. Little lakes, big lakes, small lakes, medium-sized lakes. Welcome to Iron River. Sasquatch. <laughs> Iron River. Liquor in the woods. Family Dollar does not look like it's there anymore. Well, maybe. I don't know. The sign looks like it was like somebody tried to wash it with white paint. And then the store didn't like have a sign on it. So I don't know. There's a Dollar General for you. See the scenic 13s coming up somewhere up here. Highway 13 North, trucks over 20 tons, follow detour. You ever get a chance? That's a beautiful uh, drive, uh, the scenic 13. If you're ever way up here, in the North Woods. I can't even talk. <laughs> Ashland, 24 miles.
wind is so very windy right now. to nowhere just goes up into the sky. <laughs> staying two lanes. I did not realize it was staying two lanes. I thought it was only going to be one and then that's kind of cool. We'll take it. good thing is the window's getting washed. So that's nice. Perfect timing. here I literally thought we were gonna go for a while I was getting all excited two lanes pretty awesome
the forest. I honestly didn't even know we were in the forest, to be honest. clean windshield now. What is this that we're coming to? Inno? Inno, Wisconsin. Delta Mason that way. So we're in Inno, Wisconsin. Never even heard of it. However, that road back there looked like it would have been a fun road to drive on. It was all wavy. But I don't really have a whole lot of time, so... North 
Fish Creek. Where a lot of trees have fallen. <laughs> miles away so I think some of this area out here may be where there's elk now that would be pretty cool to actually come across and see see those from a distance obviously not on the road but I believe uh, this area up here is where there may be elk I could be wrong though I've been wrong before in the past on certain things, so... Um, not 100% sure, though. It would be cool to see them on the side of the road. I'm not talking about wild elk. I'm not talking about elk that are behind a fence. That, I, that I, I, I mean, that's cool. But like, I, well, it'd be cool to see. But like, I want to see them just like roaming freely. That'd be kind of cool. We're gonna be coming into Keystone uh, Township which I believe is where somebody had posted on a Facebook group that I belonged to. There was a picture of an elk, I think, uh, but I, I'm not 100% sure.
So there's a body water coming up here shortly that'll be off to the left. And I'm trying to think if that's Lake Superior or what that is. I, again, I'm not 100% sure. Um, I thought Ashland was like really close to Lake Superior. Maybe it'll have a sign or something. <laughs> or it's a harbor of something, maybe. Kind of looks like a harbor. Fish Creek. I feel like we passed the Fish Creek a while back. Northern Great Lakes. So we're not taking a 13 today. We've done a 13 before, uh, but won't be doing it today. Apostle Islands are that way, so. We're going two. So the last time I was through here, I believe it's up in up this up in this area up here uh, around the bend. Like the snow was blowing onto the highway as I came through. So like the lake the lake was this is actually a part of Lake Superior here. Um, off to the left, but like. The snow was, like I said, it, the, the lake was still frozen in some spots, and there was snow out there, and it was just blowing across the highway. It's kind of cool. Coming into Ashland now. <coughs> people in Ashland. they got like a railroad crossing thing there uh, in case the, like the water maybe or if the snow gets so bad from blowing that they just shut down the highway there that's pretty smart
fish right here. Fresh river rock and look at that fish. That's kind of cool. Port of Ashland, Wisconsin. Gyros. We'll have to come up here when it's a little nicer out. I'm on Lakeshore Drive, and I'm going to take this until I get to US 51 in about 36 miles. Cases of Wisconsin. Interesting. Imagine it's a bunch of cheese and beef. <laughs> and maybe breweries. Melon and Ironwood. I've been to Melon before. I'm not sure about Ironwood. Quicker tripper. <laughs> Toyota and Honda. That's interesting. Got a Walmart over here too. Oh, that Walmart's huge.
I think I'm gonna time lapse it from here uh, till we get a little closer, because uh, I don't I don't know what else you're gonna see. I mean, I imagine it's just gonna be a bunch of wooded areas. Uh, so, all right, I will catch you guys uh, when we get a little closer. Got about an hour and 33 minutes to go, or 87 miles. That's cool. Very cool. So we're currently in Ironwood, Wisconsin, I believe. Um, and I figured I'd turn the camera on because that was pretty cool. So, never been up this way, but I get to experience it today. <laughs> kind of cool. So we have about 50 more miles to go, or 53. Um, I'll keep it on for a little bit, and then I'm gonna time lapse it. Uh, Cause again, we got, we got a little ways to go still. So about 53 minutes. It's currently 3:42, which is kind of nice. Um, yeah. It's just funny because as we go certain places it starts pouring down rain or it's not raining and yeah and as I start talking then it starts pouring again so kind of interesting oh it looks like we got some lakes over here I wonder what lake this is of a bigger lake. Ooh. Is that a road? Oh, that is a road that goes across. Interesting.
Yeah, I'm not sure what this lake is over here called over here to the right. That's interesting. The ATV up against the tree back there. to make up its mind. Either it's going to rain or it's not going to rain. <laughs> going back and forth is just making it very weird. something else today. Fifty one degrees too now. <laughs>
8.51 and it already looks like it's 9 o'clock at night. <laughs> Just because it's so dark. That's kind of crazy, huh? <laughs> sneaky back there. There's one hiding back in the woods back there. <laughs> Some turkeys. Blackbirds. They look like turkeys from a distance. 
I did not want, I do not want to hit a turkey or a blackbird for that matter. Or any animal, I should say. I don't want to hit anything. Don't mind seeing them on the side of the road, just don't cross in front of my path. Another 34 miles. 34 miles, I didn't see a sign for a forest, but I wonder if this is a forest. Like a national forest is what I was referring to. I know it's a forest, you can see it's a forest, but uh, like I've, been, I've seen a couple signs over the times that I've been up here for uh, national forests. So. Weber Creek. I think I'm gonna time lapse it because we still got like another half hour to go uh, before we get there. So um, we'll go from there. Alright, so we're currently, again, the whole drive, we're, we're through the Northwoods, but we're coming into 
uh, the Northwoods uh, Arbor, I can't even say the name, uh, but it's where the Harley Davidson dealership is up here in the Northwoods. It's referred to as uh, Northwoods Harley Davidson dealership. We're about 13 miles away. They close at five according to what I saw on Google and it is 419. So I'll get there around 4, 4, 433 hopefully. And I hope that that Google thing is correct. If not, oh well, not gonna lose sleep over it. Um, yeah, so. Yeah, the whole area where we're at right now is all wooded and then lakes. There's lakes and rivers all around us. It's very interesting. There's like little lakes, big lakes. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Kind of an interesting drive. Like I said, I, me and Gwen have never been up here, so, like, this is all new to us. Currently 63 degrees outside. Diamond Lake.
eight miles away for nine minutes. This area of the highway up here reminds me, it seems very similar to, I can't remember if it's 16 or 8, that runs from Macon, Georgia, all the way to like the Savannah, like uh, like to the coast. Uh, the, like with all the trees and stuff like that. However, down there, it's just trees all along the highway. There's nothing to see up here. You can see the lakes in between the, the trees and stuff. So that's kind of cool. Uh, but down there, you're, you're just seeing trees. But it, it's, it's kind of similar. Got this similar vibe. course that highway down there like I said outside of Macon uh, that runs uh, like all the way to Savannah like that's like a hundred and thirty or hundred and fifty mile road uh, or highway where up here I, I'm not even sure I don't even know how long we've been going on this on, on two and then 51 so but 51 once you get further south it, uh, it it's a four-lane highway uh, I believe it's 5139, if I remember correctly. Uh, and it runs right through Wausau. No, 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 no. So it looks like we're actually coming into Arbor Vitae, Arbor Vitae, Wisconsin. And I'm probably slaughtering it. In fact, I know I am. Uh, but at least I tried. Sparkling Lake here. Another lake over here. Again, there's lakes all around us up here. these white spots right here must be where the trails are I was wondering what those were like they're quite a bit on a side like going across the road but basically it's where the trail crosses the road that makes sense now to kind of let the people know hey there's a trail there trail that comes across the road I'm suspecting during the summertime like I said we're we're only like I said May uh, 10th you know I mean it's it's starting uh, I'm suspecting the season will be picking up here pretty shortly but during the summertime I'm suspecting this area up here gets quite crazy <clears throat> with all the cabins and you got all the lakes up here too I mean all around us there's lakes
feeling so good. <laughs> and then it started raining again. tenths of a mile and we'll be at the North Woods Harley Davidson dealership that's exciting and then basically I've got all the Harley Davidson dealership I've been to a visit all the Harley Davidson dealerships in the northern part of Wisconsin and I think I've got like three maybe four more to go on Alaska, Real Brothers in Wisconsin Dales, and then there's one in Milwaukee, and there may be another one uh, that I may be missing. But that's pretty exciting. And here's the Harley Davidson dealership. I almost passed it. I was, that came quick. North Woods Harley Davidson. All right, so we just left the Northwoods here, a Harley, or we're gonna be living in Northwoods Harley Davidson dealership, and I figured I'd show you. So I got a patch for Gwen. She, she has a bag that she's putting patches on. I thought that was kind of cool. I love how the detail at the woods and uh, the sunset, or I guess you could say sunset, not so much sunrise. Um, and then I ended up getting the lapel pin here, which is pretty awesome. And then uh, the shot glass uh, with Northwoods on it. I will have to take this out of here to show you. Thought that was kind of cool. So very neat. So glad that I got this. And I finally made the trip up here. Uh, so cool. So with that, guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Um, and this was a trip from, um, where were we at? Patterson State Park uh, to here in Arbor of, of I'm going to say the Northwoods uh, Harley-Davidson dealership because I honestly don't know how to uh, say that name uh, because it's kind of weird. And, um, yeah, if you like this kind of content, please feel free to subscribe, like, share. And with that, I'll catch you guys on the next videos, our next video here, there, and everywhere. Talk to you on the next one. Take care.